Welcome to the Servant video tutorial series. Today, I will be walking you through the steps to set up your first cPanel user account through WHM. You will need to set up a cPanel user account before you can access the bulk of cPanel and WHM's functionality. To do this, log into your WHM account through your Servant portal. Once inside WHM, locate the Create a New Account option under Account Functions. An easy way to find account functions is to type the word account into the search bar. After selecting create a new account, enter your domain name in the domain field, then select a username and password. It is important to select a secure password. You can use the generator to create a very secure password. Enter the email address the server is permitted to contact you at. While the remaining options are typically left on the default setting, knowing what they all do can be quite helpful. The package dropdown lets you utilize a pre-saved set of options for defining the account settings. If this is the first account you are setting up, there will be no packages saved. We will discuss setting up a package in another tutorial. Below this, you can set the cPanel settings. cPanel theme sets the visual look of your cPanel. You can always change this later if you wish, so for now, you can choose whichever sounds the most appealing. Locale allows you to select which language you would like the account to operate under. You then choose whether or not the account is a reseller account. A cPanel account which is marked as a reseller will be able to make additional cPanel accounts tiered under their account. This can be useful for your personal master account, so you may as well set your account to a reseller account. Next, it is time to configure your DNS settings. You can opt to activate Domain Keys Identified Mail DKIM, or Sender Policy Framework SPF, which are used to prevent mail spoofing from your domain. You can also use name servers specified at the domain's registrar if you are using off-server name servers. Checking the Overwrite Any Existing DNS Zones for the account ensures that any DNS zone conflicts that arise are resolved by overwriting the existing DNS zones, so the new account's domain can begin propagating. At this point, you can configure the mail routing settings. If you don't have specific changes in mind, however, it is recommended to leave it configured with the Automatically Detect Configuration setting. Finally, hit the Create button. Your cPanel user account will be created. You can check its activation by clicking on the List Accounts link on the sidebar. List Accounts displays all cPanel user accounts created under the root WHM instance. Thank you for watching this Servant video tutorial. We'll see you next time.